Hello today's video we have the following content. Salted hands, fake acting, bullying by using acting, these phenomena in the film and television industry should be changed. In recent years, the chaos in the entertainment industry has been frequently exposed, which has aroused widespread public concern. Wu Jing once advised young girls to be cautious in entering this industry in an interview, believing that there are many unknown dangers and pressures hidden in it. Wu Jing's advice is not groundless. For example, Chow Yun Fat beat up an actress on the set, Zhang Weijian caused serious injuries to the rival actor due to careless filming, Zhang Han was accused of groping an actress during filming, and Wang Dalu's various confusing behaviors all reflect some improper phenomena in the entertainment industry. In addition, Zhang Ziwei was exposed to the scandal of sexually assaulting an actress, which was even more shocking. These incidents not only caused great harm to the victims, but also seriously damaged the image of the entire industry. In this context, the public called for improving the professional quality of practitioners and emphasizing the importance of respecting others and abiding by professional ethics. This is not only to protect the victims, but also to maintain the healthy development of the entire entertainment industry. As public figures, the words and deeds of actors and other practitioners are widely concerned. Their behavior not only represents individuals, but also represents the image of the entire industry. Therefore, eliminating improper behavior and establishing sound professional norms have become urgent issues that need to be addressed in the current entertainment industry. By improving professionalism and strengthening industry supervision, the entertainment industry is expected to regain the public's trust and create a more positive image. I hope that the future entertainment industry can move forward steadily on the path of morality and art and become a true cultural leader. The entertainment industry has always been considered by the public to be a chaotic field. Wu Jing once mentioned, girls should not enter the entertainment industry. After witnessing these abnormal phenomena, I really realized the meaning of your circle is really chaotic, and this atmosphere really needs to change. Chow Yun Fat beats up an actress on the set. Chow Yun Fat can be said to be a senior predecessor in the entertainment industry. He entered the entertainment industry early and won the love of the audience with a series of outstanding works. The roles he played are deeply rooted in the hearts of the people, and he has also devoted great enthusiasm and efforts to the profession of actor, so he has accumulated a large number of fans. Chow Yun Fat's action scenes have also won high praise. His fighting scenes in the play are wonderful and the audience cheered. However, actors who work with Chow Yun Fat often feel very strenuous. When Chow Yun Fat starred in the movie Tiger Out, it was his first collaboration with the heroine Lizzie H.I. At that time, Lizzie H.I. had just entered the entertainment industry, was still unknown, and encountered a lot of suppression and exclusion in the industry. In the movie Tiger Out, Chow Yun Fat suffered a lot because of his overly straightforward attitude and his persistence in perfection. Due to the difficulty of a fight scene, Lizzie H.I. suggested using a double to complete this scene, but this request was rejected. Lizzie H.I. had no choice but to go on stage in person, but in the fight scene, Chow Yun Fat did not consider the care that Lizzie H.I. should receive as a woman. During the filming process, Lizzie H.I. was kicked against the glass, dragged on the ground, and her face was smeared with paste. This series of operations caused Lizzie H.I. to suffer severely. At the end of the filming, Lizzie H.I. even needed to be carried away from the scene. In addition to Lizzie H.I. feeling extremely troubled when filming with Chow Yun Fat, Maggie Chun also publicly stated that the pressure of co-acting with Chow Yun Fat was very high. Maggie Chun revealed that when filming intimate scenes, although the director often called for a stop, Chow Yun Fat often did not stop the action immediately, and many times Maggie Chun had to force him away. This series of revelations plunged Chow Yun Fat into a whirlpool of public opinion. Afterwards, Chow Yun Fat explained in an interview that he had no ulterior motives, but was just too immersed in the role. Whether it was because he was too immersed in the role or had other purposes, Chow Yun Fat's various actions did cause considerable trouble to the actresses who performed on the same stage with him. Dicky Chun beat up his opponent so hard that he couldn't walk. Dicky Chun became famous for playing the role of Ziya Oyer in Little Fish and Flower without a miss, and became popular all over the country. This work made more audiences familiar with the actor Dicky Chun, but an unpleasant thing happened during the filming. In Little Fish and Flower without a miss, there is an extremely hateful character, Jiang Bi. In one of the scenes, after Jiang Bi died, it was originally set to scold his corpse. However, Dicky Chun made a brand new suggestion at this time. He believed that instead of severely accusing the corpse, it would be better to violently attack the corpse, 
so as to better express anger and the final effect would be more dramatic. Of course, the director adopted Dickie Chun's suggestion and decided to agree to use fake fighting before filming. However, during the actual filming process, Wong Ba's Heo was actually hit by a fist. When acting, Wong Ba's Heo could only endure it silently and did not dare to make a sound. During the end of the scene, Wong Ba's Heo suffered severe trauma both physically and mentally and was sent to the hospital for treatment. In particular, his left leg was diagnosed as being severely injured and could no longer walk. This incident has attracted widespread public attention, and Zhang Weijian and Nicholas Tse had to visit Wang Ba's Heo in the hospital under public pressure. However, after experiencing such a huge grievance, Wang Ba's Heo did not choose Zhang Weijian to visit him, but chose to forgive and directly take the matter to court. In the end, the problem was resolved through Zhang Weijian's public apology. Zhang Han attacked the breast of an actress. Zhang Han, who was once popular, is now entangled in negative news, mainly because he is deeply involved in the whirlpool of public opinion that harasses actresses. Zhang Han quickly became famous for playing the role of Mu and Yan He in Let's Watch Meteor Shower together. Subsequently, he played the role of a domineering CEO in several dramas, such as Feng Tang and Sham Sham is Coming, which further consolidated his image as a domineering CEO in the hearts of the audience. Zhang Han's development in the entertainment industry in the past few years can be described as smooth sailing, and his film and television resources and endorsement opportunities have remained at a fairly superior level. However, Zhang Han completely subverted the image of a domineering CEO in the TV series Gentlemen of East District 8, causing serious damage to his reputation and also causing him to fall into a negative public opinion storm. Zhang Han once again played the role of a domineering CEO in Gentlemen of East District 8, However, his performance in this drama has caused widespread controversy. First of all, Zhang Han has always had certain deficiencies in acting since his debut. Despite this, his acting flaws have not been significantly exposed over the years, mainly due to the advantages of the role itself. However, in this drama, the role played by Zhang Han was described by many netizens as greasy. During the performance, he even made a move on the actress and was accused of salty pig hands. Zhang Han believes that grabbing the actress' shoulder straps from behind and caressing the actress' thighs are very domineering and charming behaviors, but these behaviors have caused strong discomfort among netizens. In an interview before the broadcast, Zhang Han revealed that he had been preparing for this play for many years and the script production was carefully selected by him. However, the final effect was not as expected, which also caused Zhang Han to fall into the whirlpool of public opinion. In fact, this situation has also appeared in Zhang Han's other play Warm Strings, when he also had similar salty pig hands behavior. However, it did not attract widespread attention from netizens at that time. In the play Gentlemen of East District 8, whether it was Zhang Han's initiative, being deeply involved in the role and doing it intentionally, or the arrangement of the script and the director's requirements, netizens expressed great dissatisfaction with this behavior. Zhang Han gave people an extremely bad impression and he was therefore labeled as greasy. Wang Dalu's confusing behavior to attract attention. Wang Dalu has also been caught in a similar public opinion storm. His image among many netizens is quite bad, and his popularity is not ideal, which is mainly attributed to some of his confusing behaviors. After Wang Dalu and Lee King Kuo starred in a drama, the drama launched an event for publicity needs. At the event, Wang Dalu put his head on Lee King's body without any warning and this action was obviously without Lee Kin's consent. Faced with this sudden situation, Lee Kin seemed very shocked, but she still chose to cooperate and continue the embarrassing scene. This is not the first time that Lee Kin has encountered similar harassment. In an event she participated in with Lee Yifen, some of Lee Yifen's actions made Lee Kin deeply embarrassed. However, in the face of many shots, Lee Kin could only hold back in order to maintain the face of the two in better cooperation. Wang Dalu's confusing actions did not stop there. In a movie promotion event, he kissed the female director on the spot in order to attract attention, which aroused the dissatisfaction and disgust of many netizens. He even promised netizens that if the popularity of this movie reached a certain height, he would swim naked in the swimming pool. Wang Dalu not only made such a promise, but also uploaded the relevant video to the internet. He did not violate the agreement with netizens, but this behavior did make many netizens feel unacceptable. Wang Dalu's series of confusing actions have made him have a bad reputation among netizens. Old Pervert Zhang Zhewei In the entertainment industry, actresses often suffer more harm for various reasons. Among the many scandals, 
Zen Tsui is undoubtedly one of the most controversial figures, because some of his behaviors can indeed find obvious evidence. Zen Tsui once directed and acted in a movie, and the leading actress was the new actress Yu Kyan-Win. For a newcomer, being able to play the leading role in a film directed by a big director like Zhang Tsui is actually a very high starting point. However, Yu Kyan-Win suffered in human harm in this movie. There is a large-scale clip in the film. During the filming, the crew had made full psychological preparations with the leading actress Yu Kyan-Win, and promised to strictly control the scale during the filming process. However, during the actual filming process, Yu Kyan-Win's feelings were not considered, and she directly took action and tore her clothes hard. Although Yu Kyan-Win shouted loudly, the staff on the scene did not respond. After the filming, Yu Kyan-Win was still crying, which attracted the attention of the staff on the scene. At this time, she had suffered great psychological torture. After the incident was exposed, Zhang Tsui also suffered great pressure from public opinion. Although the scene with Yu Kyan-Win was not included when the movie was released, the scene caused irreparable psychological damage to her. After filming the movie, Yu Kyan-Win finally chose to quit the entertainment industry. This incident made Zhang Tsui deeply involved in the whirlpool of public opinion. In fact, similar situations are not uncommon with Zhang Tsui. As a well-known director, he often uses his power to behave inappropriately towards actresses, and usually attributes these behaviors to work needs. Not only Yu Kyan-Win was harmed, but more actresses and female stars also suffered under Zhang Tsui's control. In the entertainment industry, actresses are often in a weak position in similar chaos. Many male actors who are lecherous often use the excuse that they're too deep into the play, which makes many female stars who are taken advantage of can only eat bitter gossip and cannot speak. I hope that the stars in the entertainment industry can improve their professionalism and not take advantage of the opportunity of acting to do improper things. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,